Raven Elise TV. Hey guys, what's up? It's Raven. Today I'm going to be doing a try on haul, just kind of showing you some of the stuff that I have recently purchased and stuff that I've recently been showing on my Instagram. If you follow me on Instagram, you may have seen me wearing some of these pieces, but I just kind of wanted to share everything and tell you where I got everything. Some of it is like sexy date night, some of it is really casual, some of it is really good for the warm weather now that summer is coming, and most of it is pretty affordable. So I am going to link everything down below low for you guys so yeah I just wanted to share everything give you guys links to everything and also kind of somewhat show you how I would style most of these pieces so one of the main things that I wanted to show you guys in this video and talk about are the new pairs of jeans and denim shorts that I got I was struggling so much to find denim that fit me if you guys watch my snapchat rants you already know what I'm talking about I'm a pretty thin person and I'm also tall so sometimes the sizing is just really difficult for me but I went to American Eagle thanks to you guys' suggestions on my Snapchat. I always forget about American Eagle, but their stuff actually fits me really well and I like the quality and the styles of their jeans. So I got these light wash mom jeans from American Eagle. I wear a size double zero. They fit me exactly how I would want them to fit. I guess you could say they're a little short on me because they're not like a long length or anything. They're just the regular length but they didn't come in a long length, but I feel like for mom jeans, it's okay for them to be a little short like this. Most American Eagle jeans do actually come in a long length if you do need those extra inches on your inseam, but for the mom jeans, they didn't. The bralette I'm wearing is from Urban Outfitters. It's just like a stretchy kind of sports bra type vibe. I just got it because I really, really like the color. I think it was part of like their yoga fitness workout stuff, but you know, I don't work out, I just like to wear it because it's cute. All right, this next outfit, and I use the term outfit loosely because they're not really like fully complete outfits. A lot of these things kind of need a jacket, they need more accessories, but I'm kind of just showing you the main pieces. This lace bralette is from Pretty Little Thing. I love little bralettes, if you can't tell already, especially now that I got my new girls. Okay, I paid a lot of money for these things, I'm gonna show them off sometime. So I know it's a bit much, but this is kind of like date night, going out vibes, even festival vibes depending on how you style it so I think it's really cute and then these jeans are also from American Eagle just like the last jeans they are also size double zero like the other ones and they are also not in a long length they are just regular length but again I kind of like the length of these just as they are but again American Eagle does have long lengths if you guys are looking for them these jeans fit me really well they fit around the waist which is what is most important to me and then I'm also wearing these black Black heels which I got from Fashion Nova they're like a pointed toe strappy sandal and the straps can actually be worn different ways and yeah it's just a simple black heel black lace top pair of jeans cute little quick date night outfit throw a jacket over it and you're good to go I also wanted to give you guys a quick breakdown of where I like to get my jeans since I do get that question a lot obviously since I am a tall slim person I look for smaller waist sizes and longer inseams and I also look for jeans that have more of a classic feel to them I don't really like the stretchy jeggings with all the crazy distressing and crazy markings on them I just kind of like something that looks like you know a classic pair of Levi's light wash medium wash distressing that looks natural that really looks like it's just a pair of vintage jeans so the top places that I've been able to find jeans like that in my proper sizing are American Eagle obviously like I just showed you guys ASOS which is online so you do have to kind of guess your size use the size chart it's pretty accurate but once you order your first pair you'll be able to know what size to order next time but ASOS has really long inseams as well Topshop also has small waist sizes with long inseams and and I also recently went to PacSun and I noticed that they go really, really small and really slim. Not necessarily really long, but if you are a slim person, you might want to check out PacSun as well. I've also recently purchased some really nice jeans from Urban Outfitters because they sell like Levi's and more higher quality brands and also Free People for that same reason because they sell the higher quality name brands. So I've recently been kind of splurging when it comes to jeans, but I think that's okay because jeans
jeans are such a classic wardrobe piece that you're always gonna wear you want them to fit really nicely you want them to be high quality and hold up through multiple washings and stuff like that so I would definitely recommend saving up and splurging for a really good pair of jeans from any of these stores that I've mentioned moving on to these three tops that I got from cotton on I hadn't been to cotton on in the mall in a long time but I realized that they actually do have some pretty good basic pieces so I got these three tube tops they came in a bunch of different colors including like red and blue and green and all that stuff but I just got these three in brown white and black and I absolutely love these tube tops they are actually made really really well the fabric that they're made out of is perfect it's nice and thick it fits really well it doesn't slide down it's not see-through you can actually wear this top without a bra you guys know how it is with tube tops and they always are like sliding down and they just don't fit right but these fit amazingly they were $12.99 and I did get three of them at first I felt like that was kind of a lot of money for just three basic tube tops because I have seen these at other places for much cheaper like just a few dollars I actually ordered some from pretty little thing that came in a pack of two for I think like only ten dollars but those were really bad quality they were see-through and they did not fit right they were just made out of like this like slinky material these on the other hand like I said are made really really well and honestly when it comes to basic pieces you might think it's stupid to spend more money on just a plain black tube top or a plain white t-shirt or plain tank top whatever it might be but it actually is better to spend a little bit more money and get something that's made out of a better fabric that's just overall higher quality it's gonna hold up in the wash it's gonna fit you a lot better because basic pieces are the pieces that you're gonna want to wear over and over again in a bunch of different ways so you're gonna want them to hold up and you're gonna want them to fit right so I was really happy that I found these and I didn't mind paying $12.99 each for them and I would actually highly recommend them so I am gonna try and link them down below for you guys the next item that I wanted to show you guys are these shorts that I'm wearing these are from American Eagle just like the other two pairs of jeans again I was having such a hard time finding the correct sizing I went to every single store in the mall and I tried on so many pairs of denim shorts and nothing was fitting me properly I was trying on every single smallest size that I could find I ended up at American Eagle I ended up with a size double zero and these are the ones that fit the best as you can see they're like a tiny tiny bit big I guess technically but it's okay I like for my shorts to be comfortable I don't want them to be skin tight anyway plus these are kind of like a high-waisted mom jean vintage type style so if they're a little bit baggy it's okay but I just didn't want them to be too baggy or you know you know there's like a certain way that these are supposed to fit and these ones fit me the best by far next up I got these platform lace-up sandals from pretty little thing I've been seeing a lot of people wear these recently and I wanted to try them out for myself and they're really cute I really like them so I'm going to show you kind of a simple little spring summer outfit I'm also wearing this little ruffly crop top which is also from pretty little thing I love the blush pink color and I just think it's a cute little top it's something kind of different with the way that it's shaped and I'm pairing it with my denim shorts and these platform sandals and I just think it's a cute little casual spring look going along with the spring colors you guys know I love this mint green color so I also got this crop top also from pretty little thing beautiful light mint green color it is long sleeve but it's a crop top so I feel like it still works for spring and summer it kind of has like a I don't know a really relaxed fit to it so I decided that I would probably wear it maybe tied up in the middle with tops like these I definitely recommend playing around with the styling you know where the sleeves rolled up where the top of it pushed off of the shoulder try tying it up in the middle or tying it up off to the side like there's a lot of different ways that you can wear tops you don't just have to wear it the the way that it was you know necessarily intended on the model on the website I wanted to also show you guys these other denim shorts that I actually got from cotton on which I was really surprised to find that cotton on of all places had denim shorts that fit me properly after I already checked everywhere in the mall that's the last place that I would have thought would have actually had it but they had my size and I think these are a pretty cute you know color and style they're not my favorite I don't like them as much as I like the other ones from American Eagle but at this point I was just on Honestly, happy to find some shorts that fit around my waist so I can kind of cuff them up a little bit and make them work but I'm actually planning on probably cutting the bottom hem and making them look a little bit more distressed and I'll probably like them a little bit more that way so yeah these are pretty decent they're actually made out of a pretty high quality denim so they're pretty nice but they're just not my top favorite and then I'm wearing this black top from pretty little thing which is just pretty much a basic black long sleeve crop top but the cool thing about it is that you can actually take off the little tie and it turns 
turns into just like a regular crop top and you could actually probably do something else with the tie if you wanted to so it's kind of like a little versatile crop top which I like I love clothes like this that can be slightly transformed to look like a different shirt so you can wear it more than once but it looks like a different look next up are these high-waisted mom jeans that I got from Urban Outfitters like I said earlier Urban Outfitters carries more of that classic vintage look so these I actually am mad at myself because I ordered them online I was just kind of guessing my size and I actually really needed to go down one more size I think I got them in a size 26 and I either needed like a 25 or a 24 which they did have so I should have got those but I wore them I took the tag off of them and I washed them and everything so now I can't return them so I'm kind of stuck with the baggier size but I do kind of feel like the baggy thing could kind of be a look so I'm like okay I'll keep them I'll probably still end up wearing them but I might go on the website and order another pair in a smaller size as well and the shirt I'm wearing is from cotton on again so they had like the cute basics they actually had denim shorts and then they actually had a lot of cute t-shirts so this is just like a band tee it's for Def Leppard it has an eagle on it I liked it because it had some glitter on it and I just like the color combo and I like the fit and the quality of the t-shirt itself it's actually a really nice t-shirt so check out cotton on if you're looking for band tees and stuff like that but basically the way that I would style a t-shirt and jeans is I would always tuck in my shirt or tie it up or something just so it's not too baggy and boxy looking and then you could wear it with a pair of heels so I have some heels from Fashion Nova I have these neon pink heels and I have those black heels that I already showed you earlier obviously most people would probably go with the black heels to kind of go with the color scheme of this outfit but I thought it would be fun to just throw on a pair of neon pink heels I know the shirt doesn't have neon pink in it but for some reason I kind of just felt like it still kind of went together I don't know try something new everything doesn't have to be so matchy matchy I personally thought it looked cute together of course you could always just pair it with a red heel and I do have a pair of strappy red heels that would match a little bit better and kind of just be a little bit more I don't know make more sense but I thought the neon pink was cute too along with the Def Leppard shirt I also got this other shirt from Cotton On I'm not sure what this is on the shirt I think it says Serenity or something like that but since this shirt actually does have pink on it I guess it matches a little bit better with the neon pink heels so I would wear it like this too but yeah I never just wear my t-shirts just plain I always either tuck them in or tie them up and cuff up the sleeves it just gives it a more stylized more feminine look rather than just like a plain frumpy t-shirt all right so I've got the white tube top from cotton on that I showed you guys earlier and I'm pairing it with these new pair of adidas sweatpants that I got I'm surprised that I didn't already own these but these are just kind of like the basic black women's adidas sweatpants that you've probably seen everybody wear for some reason I didn't have these so I recently bought them from Nordstrom y'all know how I feel about adidas okay it's my thing it's my favorite brand they just I don't know what it is I just love it so if they make it I'm gonna buy it so I have quite a collection of adidas sweatpants and leggings I just really like the quality of them I like the logo I like the stripes I just like it so nothing really too special about this look but it's just kind of an everyday casual casual comfy look although I have been seeing lately that a lot of people have been taking you know sporty loungewear like this and dressing it up and wearing it with heels and nicer accessories and actually wearing it more for like a date night night out type of look so I wanted to try that for myself so I switched to the black tube top because I felt like that was just a little bit more like nighttime appropriate and I'm pairing it with this little belt bag fanny pack thing that I got from Pretty Little Thing which I think is super cute it's kind of got like a snake skin type feel to it and it's got the gold chain so I tried to like pair this together I wasn't quite sure where I was going with this look but I felt like adding this bag and wearing it with a pair of black heels might actually be a look so I paired it with my Socate Louboutin pumps and I actually really like this look like Am I crazy or is this cute? Like, I actually think it's pretty cute. And speaking of fanny packs, I also wanted to show you guys this Adidas fanny pack that I got from Urban Outfitters. Of course, it's Adidas, so that's what caught my eye, but also I like the fact that the details on it are gold. I love the combination of black and gold. And I am gonna be going to a music festival, so I thought this might come in handy for that. But also, it's just kind of like a cute little accessory to pair with any like casual outfit. I like how I've been seeing people wear it like going across 
across like a crossbody bag I think that that's really cute so yeah I mean I'm trying to branch out when it comes to my accessories and stuff and find different things to kind of spice up my outfits and I think fanny packs are a good way to do that and real quickly I just wanted to show you guys the comfy stuff that I got so it's not really like a cute outfit or anything it's mostly just to like run errands hang around the house that type of vibe so these are the black adidas leggings they look really similar to the black sweatpants that I just had on but these are the leggings so they're made out of a really nice stretchy soft material I absolutely love adidas leggings they're like my favorite they're just super comfy and they fit really well I get mine in a size small and they fit me perfectly I have them in a bunch of different colors but I didn't have this particular style in black so I recently got these and then the top I'm wearing is from free people recently I've been going to free people and checking out like their kind of like active wear yoga section because they have like these nice stretchy tops and sports bras and leggings and stuff and I don't do yoga and I don't work out but I like to wear that type of stuff just to lounge around in so I found these really cute um, little spaghetti strap crop tops they're kind of made out of like a sports bra like thick stretchy material so you don't have to wear a bra with it and it's got this really cute crisscross detail in the back I just really like the quality of it the way that they fit I think that you could easily work out in these and do yoga and stuff like that but it's also just like a cute top to lounge around in or even just wear it with jeans or whatever so I got it in black and I also got it in this kind of purpley color and of course you can't talk about Raven's favorite loungewear without mentioning a good old adidas t-shirt so I have added this peach colored shirt to my adidas t-shirt collection I just absolutely love this color again I love the material that adidas makes their t-shirts out of it's really soft and comfy and I just love it okay I don't know why I just do and I like getting a bunch of different colors so this is my most recent purchase and I just think it's really pretty okay now getting back to some of the more dressy cute stuff I have been wanting this outfit ever since I saw that photo of Kourtney Kardashian wearing this outfit I don't know what brand or what designer hers was back when she wore it but pretty little thing came out with basically an exact knockoff of the outfit and I just couldn't resist because I loved it so much and the crazy thing about this is that these pants are not from the tall section they're not like a special long pair of pants but they actually fit me these are just their regular sizing I think I got these in a size 2 or a size 4 I'll list it for sure down in the description box for you guys but they fit me I don't know for some reason they were just long enough and then I also paired it with the lavender colored velvet crop top this did not come as a set but it was shown on their website as a set because this is how Kourtney Kardashian wore it and yeah I just think it's such a cute outfit such a pretty color I don't own a lot of this color in my wardrobe and yeah I was just really surprised at how well the pants actually fit me so by the time that you guys are watching this video I have already worn this outfit out as you see it here with the top and the pants together but I do also think that you could wear the pants with a different top and wear the top with different pants so I plan to style it in a couple of different ways in the future so obviously most of the stuff in this video is from pretty little thing because I placed a huge online order for them recently so this outfit is also from pretty little thing it did not come as a set the um, pants are like a really soft really thick I don't even know kind of velvety kind of corduroy-ish material so it's not like your typical sweatpants and they had this neon green stripe going down the front of it so I thought it would be cute to pair it with a neon green crop top so I went searching around their website for the perfect colored crop top and I found this one and I just think it pairs really nicely together because it makes the piping on the pants pop and then there actually was a matching hoodie for these pants as well so I went ahead and got the hoodie just because I really don't know why it's spring it's summer I really don't need to be buying hoodies but it matched with the pants and I felt like I needed to have the matching set maybe for later on next winter I might just want to wear it together just to be comfy but originally I had planned just to wear the pants with the crowd top so yeah this is just me trying to step outside of my comfort zone a little bit I don't normally wear you know bright neon colors like this I usually stick to pastels and neutrals so yeah just 
trying something different. All right, so this last look is definitely one of my favorites. It's this black sheer ruffly top that I got from Pretty Little Thing, originally available from House of CB, I later realized. So either one, I'll try to link one down below. But it's this really cute black sheer ruffly top and I paired it with the same jeans that I showed you guys earlier from American Eagle. And of course, you could definitely wear this with black heels, like those black strappy heels that I showed from Fashion Nova earlier or my black pumps that I showed but I wanted to do something a little bit different a little bit less predictable and I paired it with these rose gold lace-up sandals that are from Fashion Nova I just think it's a nice little pop of something different instead of just you know wearing a black heel and I love these heels they're definitely not comfortable but I don't look for comfort when I buy heels beauty is pain heels are meant to be cute not comfortable so no they're not comfortable but they're really really cute and I really like them and I just like the way this whole look came together of course I could add some more accessories to this look like a necklace and a bag and maybe different earrings or whatever but just kind of the overall idea I really like the romantic kind of sexy deep V top for like a date night look and then just pairing it with some jeans to kind of tone it down a little bit so it's not too formal and then boom throw on a really cute heel this is my type of look oh and I also like this top so much that I ordered it in the nude color as well but I just didn't feel like trying it on you guys can probably imagine how it looks but yeah that's everything I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you got some ideas inspiration styling inspiration places to shop inspiration everything will be linked down below for you guys so check out the description box if you are interested in anything that you saw in this video give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next one bye